Let's meet Baxter, our research robot. Hey Baxter, how are you doing? Hey Baxter, catch! My name is Marco Tempest and I'm a cyber illusionist, which means I combine magic and science to create illusions. Now if there's one technology that has always symbolized the future, it's the robot. My name is David Nunez. I'm a researcher at the MIT Media Lab studying personal robots. So it turns out that robots are not very smart at all. Uh, when we first got this robot, it was a completely blank slate. It had no software in it at all. So we're slowly starting to build the systems in place for it to be able to do the kinds of things that we want it to do. What's difficult about building a system like this for a performance robot is there are many moving parts, literally. There are the motors that have to move into, into various positions. There are, dozen, you know, there are dozens of variables that have to be taken into account when you build a robot system. Not only this, but this is not a robot that is just going to be doing the same thing over and over again. It's going to be performing with Marco. And Marco is not a robot. He is a human being, and his moves are going to be different in every performance he does. So the robot has to be able to adapt its movement to what Marco is doing at any given time. This is an extremely difficult robotics problem. So this is what we have so far. We have a puppeteering interface which can record poses and playback poses at timed intervals. We have a zero-g mode which enables us to pose Baxter by just grabbing him by his wrists. We can then refine the poses by going into each axis and make slight adjustments before we record the pose. So magicians are typically super introverted and secretive about their work and uh, very seldom share their knowledge with a wider world. Now we decided for the robot project uh, to let you in, to show our research and how it's developing and give you regular updates in videos and tell you where we are and how things are going. We're going to tell you about our successes and failures and I hope you can all join us for the big celebration when Baxter is actually ready to perform with me on stage. The idea of, of robots performing on stage um, with human beings has always been something that I've been super excited about. Um, I'm, I'm glad that technology has got to a place where, where we can realistically approach this, this, this problem. It's a super challenging project. There are many unknowns. Uh, this, is, this is a huge project and it's super exciting to be working on it.